New tonight, a couple of students from Deweyville refused to let these unusual times bring them down. With no school, they found an activity that not only gets them out of the house, but they get to help others. Here's Tyler Segerman. For many kids across Southeast Texas now sitting at home, the question of what can I do can be tough to answer. Yet, put in some work and you might be surprised at what's available outside. It feels good knowing that we can help other people. It's way better than sitting at the house. It gives you something to do all day. With work no longer being done inside the classroom, a couple of Deweyville seniors found something to do outside. Yard work for people in Newton and Orange County. It's just been one after another. People just asking us to like pick up wood and burn wood and chop wood, just like any little thing around the yard. This is how Ty Collier and Nate Buxton are spending their time. The two started working on yards this past weekend, charging small fees to cover gas and expenses, but say it's really about easing the burden. The least we can do is help them so they don't have to worry about it once they get home. One simple post on Friday expressing their desire to get out and help those who work or are unable to care for their yards has led to non-stop tasks for these two teens. We've been to Orange, we've done a few houses in Deweyville, we've done three houses in Mauriceville, and two houses in Bridge City. The boys say the work has helped them cope with how COVID-19 has affected their lives. They know they're bringing joy and helping their communities, but this is certainly not how they expected to finish their senior year. I would much rather be in school with my sports and academics and just having uh, finishing out the senior year strong, but I mean, you gotta work with what you got. Indeed they are, providing relief to more than just a yard. Making them happy makes us happy. The two teenagers tell me they have a lot more work to do, booked all day tomorrow and Wednesday. But if you'd like them to come out to your yard and help, that info can be found on our website at 12newsnow.com. Tyler Segerman, 12 News.